Sikorsky CH 53K King Stallion Heavy Lift Helicopter completes second successful sea trial. The United States' most advanced heavy lift helicopter, the Sikorsky CH 53K King Stallion, has just completed an intensive five day and night sea trial in the Atlantic Ocean. This test marks a crucial phase in the helicopter's development and operational validation, designed to meet the U.S. Marine Corps' heavy lift requirements in various extreme conditions. The mission took place last month aboard the amphibious dock ship USS Arlington, demonstrating significant progress from previous tests conducted in 2020. This sea trial is part of a series of advanced tests to evaluate the CH-53K's performance in complex maritime environments. The helicopter previously underwent an initial sea trial in June 2020 with positive results. This time, the testing was conducted under more challenging sea conditions, with high wind speeds and variable wind directions. Simulating real-world operational conditions in the field. A total of 105 personnel were involved in the test, including a joint team from the 21st Air Test and Evaluation Squadron, HX-21, the Heavy Lift Helicopter Program Office H-53, PMA-261, and Marine Corps units such as HMH-461 and VMX-1. They worked alongside pilots, technicians, engineers, and maintenance personnel from Sikorsky. This cross-institutional collaboration formed the foundation for the success of the testing on the U.S. Navy ship. Colonel Kate Flieger, Program Manager for PMA-261, stated that the test results showed the CH-53K has broader launch and recovery capabilities from amphibious dock ships compared to its predecessor, the ch 53. This is a significant breakthrough in enhancing the operational flexibility of helicopters on ships, which will be highly useful in expeditionary and amphibious landing scenarios. According to Sarah Naiva, Assistant Program Manager for CH 53K Testing and Evaluation, the success of these tests is attributable to the meticulous planning and hard work of all parties involved over several months. She emphasized that the helicopter is now ready to handle extreme weather conditions and complex mission scenarios where ship maneuverability is limited, while still being able to launch and recover safely. The sea trials included various key elements to assess the aircraft's compatibility with the ship. Testing was conducted on helicopter launch and recovery procedures, rotor operations, startup and shutdown, rotor blade folding, as well as maintenance and movement simulations on the ship's deck. All these procedures were conducted under varying wind conditions to test the helicopter's design robustness and operational flexibility. <laughs> One key aspect of the compatibility testing was how the aircraft could be moved around the deck and hangar, as well as how the crew could perform maintenance in the ship's confined spaces.
This evaluation is key to ensuring that the CH 53K can be used efficiently and safely in various configurations of the U.S. Navy's amphibious ships. The CH 53K King Stallion helicopter is the successor to the CH 53E Super Stallion, which has been in use since the 1980s.